All right, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, let's go over how I'm getting 45 plus mega hash on a 3060 Ti. I've seen some videos where some folks are getting 50 mega hash, and I tried their settings, but it crashes my card, increasing the M clock and all that stuff. And I have two 3060 Ti's. This one you're seeing right here is, is on a rig with a bunch of cards, different cards. It has the GDR6 Samsung memory. And if you look at my settings, it's going to be the third from the last or the fourth card in, right? Zero, one, two, three, meaning the fourth position. So my M clock is 1500. And my lock, absolute lock core clock is going to be 1400. This is T-Rex Minor version 0.24.8 and this is uh, 20 December 2021. So yeah I tried increasing the M clock. I played around some numbers but it just crashes that 3060 Ti. So I went with the, the settings I know work. I tweaked a little bit I used to have the LHR tune on the 73, but it seems like T-Rex Minor right here will tune it to 70 using the 74, and I'm getting 46.13. I'm getting a really decent hash rate right now off this Gigabyte RTX 3060 Ti. So this one you're looking at is the Samsung GD DR6 memory, eight gigabytes. Okay, let's go over to the other one running solo. Oop. All right, here we have EVGA RTX 3060 Ti. I'm at 44.21, 44.09. This has been running a bit too. I forget if we can find the duration. It's in here somewhere. I just, yeah, five days uptime. So five days, 14 hours uptime. And we have a roughly 45 mega hash at 133 watts power, 60 Celsius. What is the other guy running at? I just started this guy up. He's at roughly 45.38, a little more juice coming out, right? 45.38 versus 44.72. So we got 45.38. Power is 121. Temperature is a little bit less. Yeah, 54, so 121 watts. Let's compare watt usage. About the same watts. Little Running a little hotter. Let's see, and we're at 44. So this one is the EVGA, and it is running the GDDR6 Hynix memory. So pretty close, and the settings are exactly the same. Let's go over here to T-Rex Minor 024.8. Uh, M clock is 1500 and the absolute core clock setting is 1400. Again, if I go up higher, it gets unstable, it gets wonky. So maybe it is just luck of the draw on these CPUs. So when I see a video, a 3060 Ti with a 50 mega hash, I just can't do it. It just, it, T-Rex hates it and crashes on me. So there's the best I can do. And again, I'm running in Windows 10. I'm not running Hive OS. And I think some of the other videos I've seen were running Windows 10. So I don't know what I'm missing or it's just luck of the draw on the brand. But I have a good little sampling here of gigabyte Samsung memory with EVGA Hynix memory. Anyway, just to show you how things are different, but the same. You know what I mean? And those are my settings. So let me know if you're getting a better hash rate than roughly 45 uh, and better power usage, so 132. I like the Gigabyte one better, 45 point, almost 46 on this puppy right now. 46 on this puppy with 120 watts, 55. It's like the Gigabyte is running better than the, uh, with the Samsung, is running a lot more efficiently than the EVGA with the Hynix memory, just with the same settings and the same minor. This one is 247, but it really shouldn't matter. I mean, I'll check it. I think I will upgrade to make sure. And uh, we'll go from there. So there you go. There's my settings. There's the differences. And I'm going to do a... Uh,
pause. I'm going to upgrade this miner to 024.8. Okay, so I just updated this uh, 3060 Ti T-Rex to be running T-Rex 0.24.8, so it's the same as the other one. And this is the one with the GDR6 Hynix memory. So it, it's running the same numbers as before with version 0247. So it looks like the uh, Samsung 3060 Ti memory, this the one with the Samsung memory, does a little bit better by roughly one mega hash with the same exact settings using T-Rex Miner 024.8. Uh, but the only difference, I did just start this one up, as you can see, and it's showing LHR tuning at 74, whereas it, where it was running for a whole week, it was about 75. So these numbers will most likely come up mega hash wise. Temperature, watt, I mean, temperature will stay the same. Wattage, yeah, the wattage power will be the same, about 130, 125. So there you go. Memory matters. <laughs> Memory matters, but I cannot get 50. I don't know how to get 50 mega hash without it being unstable. So I don't know, maybe it's a special brand card. I'm not sure. So there you go, little test, tweaking around, finding out what works. Uh, always looking for input, guys. Uh, you just don't know what you don't know to you. Someone comes and says, hey, try this, and it works. And you go, hey, wow, I'm getting 50. So, all right, thanks for watching. I'm out. Take care. Boom.